Hello, welcome to Mini Orange. In this video, we will see how to create your own custom API put endpoint that will update data in the WordPress database. In this video, we are using pro version of the Mini Orange custom API plugin, which unlocks all the features. You can also download our free plugin, which has limited features from the video description. So let's start. Go to the Mini Orange custom API plugin, and here you will see the settings to generate the APIs. Enter the name for the API. Select the method as put from the list. You will now need to choose the database table, where the data will be updated. I am adding the test table, but you can select any table you wish. Select the columns as well. Select the body format, in which put data needs to be sent. If you want to update the data based on conditions, you can do so according to your requirements. By clicking on the Add Condition button, you can add multiple conditions to update the data. Also, keep the column parameter name handy, it will require it later for further configuration. Now click on the Generate API button to generate the API. We can see the API has been created. Now let's test it using Postman. You can use this API on any platform, according to your requirements. Copy the API, and go to the Postman. In Postman, select the HTTP method as put, and paste the copied API here. In the body option, choose XWWW form Erlen coded, as we did in the plugin. Enter the column name and its value you wish to update in the database table, just like I enter the ID, name, email and parameter names that we copied from the plugin, parameter values should also match database table values. Now, pass the API by clicking on send button. We can see the response is true in the body, and let's check the result in a database table. Additionally, if you want to import code in your own language, just click on the code icon, and here you can see the different languages. You just copy the code in your own language and import it. Now, the database table shows that the ID value is 9 and the name is no key, but, when I refresh, it has updated the values that were passed to Postman. Do you know how to create a custom API with the post, get, delete method? If not, we have provided the video link in the description. Please check it. Thank you for watching this video. For any other questions please drop us a query at info at